Hello everyone, welcome to the House of Horrors. Today we're going to be talking about lunch boxes. Okay, I got two of them right now. Uh, if any more come out, I can definitely collect them because I think they'd be very cool to collect. Uh, as you can see, they're pretty much traditional to the, uh, the originals back in the day. Some of them are a lot bigger, some of them are smaller. These are a little bit more exceptionally smaller than your normal lunchbox, but they are cool to collect, okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to delve into this thing here a little bit, and then I'm going to show you my other lunchbox too, which is based on the killer clowns from outer space, okay? So let's go ahead and shut this down real quick. And then what we're going to do is we're going to kind of look at this a little bit. Now, I just got this yesterday. So I want to see, uh, take a look at the actual artwork on here. It's actually really cool looking. I'm going to pull it in so you can see some aspects of it. All right. Trick or Treat. Now, this is uh, from the movie Trick or Treat with uh, Sam. A lot of you already know this. This movie is actually really cool. It's got a lot of horror elements, but it's got a very cool Halloween element to it, too. Michael Doherty, who did the actual uh, movie from uh, 2019, Godzilla King of the Monsters, he's the one that actually uh, did this movie back in 2008, I think it was. There is a short film on YouTube if you want to check it out. It's based on Sam. It's probably like the origin story to uh, Sam. But this is a very cool character, and they got a lot of it in Spirit Halloween. And you can buy them online. They're just as popular as most of those characters out there. He is extremely popular anymore. And, but anyway, let's get in close here. It's almost comic book style, which I think is really cool. All right, now you, I'm going to turn this over here so you can see the side. Okay. It's all plastic except for the... It's traditional metal and stuff, and it's got the flip uh, lock on it. Now here's Sam himself. All right. Now that you already seen that side. Uh, they're pretty much the same on both sides. And just so you know, the bottom of it. All right. It's a very cool looking lunchbox. This one here, in fact, has a thermos in it. The one from the Killer Clowns from Outer Space does not have a thermos, which just seems kind of kind of odd that they would not put a thermos in it, but it is what it is. All right. Okay, you've seen both sides of these guys, okay? This side here is the one you didn't see. And creepy little motherfuckers right there. All right. Alright, so now, let's go ahead and open this up, so you can actually see the inside of it. Now, as you can see right here, okay, it's got the indentation, because once you do get the lunchbox, you can feel it. It is raised, as they say, and the actual thermos in itself, okay, we're going to show you that here in a second. And pull this out. We don't need that in there anymore. That's the little box container that holds the thermos, okay? So we don't technically need that. Alright. Let me get this out of the way here. Alright. There's your thermos, okay? Again. It has those cool looking characters from the movie. Alright. It's really cool looking. Pull that back a bit. And there's Sam himself. And it starts with those characters again. Trick or treat, baby. There is another movie out there with Ozzy Osbourne in it. It is called Trick or Treat, but it's Trick or Treat, not Trick or Treat. And that movie is based on a rock singer, which came out in the 1980s. But he ended up getting killed by getting electrocuted, and he comes back. And it's a fucking crazy cool movie. Right. The Thermos. Okay. There's your cup. Are you drinky, drinky? All right. All right. Let me see. Yeah, there we go. 
Okay, that's the actual top. And you can probably put something on top of that. But that's what she looks like inside. It's a typical thermos. Some of them usually have handles on them, the older uh, school style ones. Yep. That's pretty cool. Right. Squeeze that back on there. Squeeze that back on there. Yeah, let me show you the inside of the lunchbox. And then I'll show you the other uh, lunchbox that I got. Now, as you can see, it is raised just like anything else. I don't know if you can see that or not. Alright. Same here with this side too. They're both pretty much the same. Okay, because they're from the both uh, different sides. But they are in fact the same picture. So with that in mind, let's put that back in there. So you can actually see what it looks like in there. Okay, we're gonna close the box. Okay, see so I you can barely fit it in there, so I think you gotta reposition it. No, that's right. Okay, we just gotta Keep the handle down. That's the key right there. All right, the handle on the cup. If it's sticking up, obviously you won't be able to close your lunchbox. All right. Now there's my lunchbox from Trick or Treat. Okay. Now let me show you the other one that I have. And this one here is the Killer Clowns. Okay. Now these are very cool. I've been collecting these things like a madman, and they've really been pushing out a lot of stuff on them. I've got Funko Pops. No, not Funko Pops. Um. I got the uh, NECA figures based on the uh, Terra Toonies, uh, Toonie Terrors. I keep getting them mixed up. I got a huge uh, collection of those. And I do got some Funko Pops. I do get, I definitely got some Funko Pops. And I've got a few other things that I do. But these are nice. These are very cool to collect. Alright, now you can see the back. This one here is very colorful. Alright. So let's open this one up, and I'll show you what it looks like inside. Absolutely nothing, but it is raised, just like the other uh, lunchbox. But for some reason, they don't have a thermos in this one here. Just the way they sold it, I guess. Or maybe it did come with one, and I never got it. But that's okay. So let's compare the sizes of them. They are, in fact, the same size, okay? Okay, so yeah, these are very cool to collect, okay? Well, anyway, that is my lunchbox collection, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell if you want to see some more videos based on some of the collections that I got. I've got a few more things coming in, but i got to wait for the pre-orders, and they got to let me know, and then we'll touch base on those. Now, I just recently did um, Super 7. They have a bunch of uh, action figures. Uh, based on the Return of the Living Dead. I just got Trash. I also got the Mohawk Zombie along with Tar Man. So I did do those. If you want to check those out, if you're into the Return of the Living Dead, there are videos uh, posted on this channel. Right? In the meantime, you guys have yourselves a good day, and I hope you enjoyed this. Okay? All right. We'll see you later. All right. Bye.